Good morning, beavers. I just woke up and today I'm going to be doing a $10 beaver budget challenge. The rules are that I have $10 for everything, which includes food, drink, transportation, etc. I must eat three meals throughout the day. I cannot use my EBT food stamps for this challenge. I must stay busy throughout the entire day and I must have like a regular enjoyable day. For breakfast this morning, I'm gonna start by signing up for Panera Sip Club because they currently have a two month free trial going on and you already know after that two months, it's gone. Thankfully, Corvallis is very walk and bike friendly. So this walk to Panera is actually pretty nice. So I got my drink and then to finish my breakfast, I headed to Everything here is already at a discounted rate, which makes it one of my favorite grocery stores for when I'm shopping on a budget. I have like a thousand tripods and I didn't think to bring one with me for this. This is probably the best setup we're gonna get, so bear with me. So breakfast, I got a blood orange energy drink from Panera. And then we have um, an apple and a banana and a protein bar. And I got those from Grocery Outlet Bargain Market. Total was 138, so I still have 862 to spend for the rest of the day. Okay, so I went home to get a little bit ready, and now I'm walking to the Dixon tennis fields to play yes. some tennis with Lydia. And then after that, I'm gonna go find some lunch. So we may have run into a small issue. I don't think the OSU tennis fields are open yet because of all the construction that they're doing. As frustrating as this was, it all still turned out okay. Lydia came and picked me up and we still went to go play tennis. Now when I say play tennis, I mean this term very loosely. Neither Lydia nor I know how to play tennis, so a lot of it was just us running around. Once we got to the playground, it got very serious. All you do all day is go on the zip line. I'm ready. So after tennis and the playground, my budget remained the same, so Lydia took me to Walmart to pick up some food for lunch. I'm just gonna make baked potatoes with broccoli and cheddar on it, and I got some corn from the side. So I have all of the stuff that I'll need for that. I got all of this at Walmart for $3.96, which leaves $4.66 for the rest of my day. All right, here is my lunch for today. I realized I missed the perfect opportunity to take the Beaver bus because all busing is actually free for students at OSU. After practice, I'm hoping to get dinner at either Local Boys or Downward Dog. So I met up with some friends at the Downward Dog, and after waiting in a line that was unnecessarily way too long, I finally decided on a $4 Polish dog, and I had 64 cents left for the night. Of course, though, my dinner was not complete without stealing a good number of fries from each of my friends. Since I only had 64 cents left, I put the 50 cents in my wallet to save for the next day to use in the coin machines. <sighs> Is that a chicken? Then I dragged my friends to Bombs Away Cafe before 9 p.m. to avoid a cover fee so we could watch the DJ. Finally, I am done with my day. We have 14 cents left from our $10 budget, so I consider this challenge a win. I will see you next time. Go Beavs!